Last month, ABC 57 News reported that 22 year old Adrian Vasquez, a man who pleaded guilty to a level five felony for child solicitation, was in the National Guard, which hindered the process of sentencing. Today, his sentencing, though, was pushed back once again. ABC 57's Deanna Gutierrez standing by for us in ABC 57 Newsroom. And Deanna, you were the only news reporter to talk with the girl's mother after the hearing this morning. That's right, Brian, and that was definitely a tough conversation to have with the family. Now, in the last hour, we reported that the National Guard has responded and condemns Vasquez's behavior. But today, the mom in tears tells me she just doesn't understand how this sentencing is being pushed back yet again. And she wanted to mention again today why and how all of this unfolded. Um, he's constantly trying to manipulate the system for his clients, so he's already pled guilty. All we have to do is go through sentencing, and now he wants to get a JAG attorney. The mother of the victim, who wished to remain anonymous, attended Adrian Vasquez's hearing this morning. She says Judge Elizabeth Hurley was forced to delay the sentencing in order to avoid an appeal by the suspect later down the road. He provided the paperwork, and the judge's hands were tied at that point because she didn't have the opportunity to review it in order to make a conscious decision on whether or not to continue their sentencing. Vasquez already pleaded guilty to an added count of child solicitation, a level five felony, which is something the National Guard says is usually followed by separation of the military. Now the victim's family is handling this continuance day by day, but mom says her daughter's pain seems to be overlooked. She's a very strong girl and I have to give her credit for that. I'm probably not taking it as well because She's my baby, and um, I feel like nobody is giving her the credit that she's due, the opportunity to have somebody say, yeah, you were hurt, and this person should be accountable for it. Now, according to that mother, Vasquez had 30 days to prove that he didn't know that taking that plea would affect his participation in the military. So this added time for her is just frustrating, to say the least. I'm live in the newsroom, Diana Gutierrez, ABC 57 News.